transformer delta star winding current with unbalanced load part 1 this video describe about transformer primary secondary winding current due to unbalanced load current this unbalanced load current means unbalanced impedance is connected to the secondary winding output then unbalanced load current will come there if learner is familiar about unbalanced load current in transformer then it is easy to them to analyze faults also that is unbalanced current with the two currents are zero that is equal to th fault unbalanced current with the one current is zero that is a two phase eth fault unbalanced current without neutral with one current is zero phase to phase fault all are explained in two parts of the videos in first part calculation of primary secondary winding current secondary load current with unbalanced load condition are explained for a transformer primary side connected with a three wire system non neutral in primary side of the transformer in this video we are going to see one delta star winding current in dyn1 transformer primary is 3 wire system secondary is 4 wire system with balanced load in secondary side number 2 star winding current in y yn0 transformer primary 3, three wire system secondary 3 wire system with unbalanced load in secondary in this video first we will calculate load current and due to unbalanced impedance connected to the secondary of the transformer from that load current we will calculate the primary current winding current using conventional method and sequence method sequence method means positive sequence negative sequence zero sequence current method in this video we will use one basic matrix matrix 1 1 1 1 minus 1 0 0 1 minus 1 inverse equal to matrix 1 by 3 2 by 3 1 by 3 1 by 3 minus 1 by 3 1 by 3 1 by 3 minus 1 by 3 minus 2 by 3 we know vry equal to vrn minus vyn vyb equal to vyn minus vbn vbr equal to vbn minus vrn in the electrical three wire system four wire systems are there in four wire system neutral wire will be there ir plus iy ib equal to in that is equal to three inr three times of zero seconds current vrn plus vyn plus vbn equal to vn that is equal to three times of v naught that is three times of zero seconds voltage vry plus vyb plus vbr equal to zero summation of phase to phase voltage equal to 0. In 3 wire system, no neutral. IR plus IY plus IB equal to 0. I naught equal to 0. 0 seconds current equal to 0. VRN plus VYN plus VBN equal to 0. That is V naught equal to 0. 0 seconds voltage is 0. VRY plus VYB plus VBR equal to 0. Summation of phase to phase voltage equal to 0. See Transformer is connected as dy1 that is i small r i small y i small b are load current in secondary or secondary star winding current i capital r i capital y i capital b are delta winding current ir minus iy iy minus ib ib minus ir are input current to transformer transformer R phase input current, H current equal to I capital R minus I capital Y. Transformer Y phase input current, H current equal to I Y minus IB. Transformer B phase input current is equal to H current equal to IB minus IR. Transformer R phase output current, LV current, I small r. Transformer Y phase output current, LV current, I small y. Transformer B phase in output current, LV current, I small b. You see the diagram that is vector of dy1 current lv current is lagging h current by 30 degree or h current is leading 
எல் வி கரண்ட் பை தேர்ட்டி டிகிரி இட் இஸ் கால்டு அஸ் டிஒய் ஒன் ஒய் டி ஒன் அண்ட் டிஒய் ஒன் கனெக்ஷன்ஸ் ஆர் சேம் எக்ஸட் ஹெச்சி அண்ட் எல் வி சைடு ஃபோர் ஃபிஃப்டீன் வோல்ட் பார் ஃபோர் ஃபிஃப்டீன் வோல்ட் ஒன் ஃபோர் ஃபோர் ஜீரோ விஏ டிஒய் என் ஒன் டென் பர்சன்ட் டிரான்ஸ்ஃபார்மர் இஸ் சோன் ஹியர் ஸ்டார் டெல்டா ஸ்டார் டிரான்ஸ்ஃபார்மர் ஸ்டார் சைடு த லோட் இஸ் அன்பேலன்ஸ் லோட் இஸ் கனெக்டட் இஜெட் ஆர் இஜெட் ஒய் இஜெட் பி த லோட் ரெசிஸ்டன்ஸ் ஒன் சைடு இஸ் கனெக்டட் டு தி ஸ்டார் சைடு ஆஃப் த டிரான்ஸ்ஃபார்மர் அனதர் சைடு ஸ்டார்டு அண்ட் கனெக்டட் டு த நியூட்ரல் தட் இஸ் கால்டு ஃபோர் வயர் சிஸ்டம் in this any unbalanced current or fault current anything is there the neutral current will flow i not will be available in zero sequence equivalent circuit if i not current flows in second side due to unbalanced load or earth fault this will reflect in delta winding primary in three wire system so no zero sequence current in primary side Zero seconds current is circulating in delta winding only. Three numbers transformers, three into four fifteen by two forty volt are connected. V T R equal to root three is to one. V R Y equal to four fifteen angle thirty. V Y B equal to four fifteen angle minus ninety. V V R equal to four fifteen angle one fifty. So V R N equal to two forty angle zero. V Y N equal to two forty angle minus one twenty. V V N equal to two forty angle one twenty. The load resistance Z R equal to two hundred ohms. Z Y equal to two hundred ohms. Z B equal to hundred ohms. Now we will see the output current. Transformer R phase output current equal to. IR equal to 240 angle 0 divided by 200 equal to 1.2 angle 0. Transfer Y phase output current, secondary current equal to IY equal to 240 angle minus 120 divided by 200 equal to 1.2 angle minus 120. Transfer B phase output current, secondary current equal to IB equal to 240 angle 120 divided by 100. equal to 2.54 angle 120 so star winding current ir is equal to 1.2 angle 0 iy equal to 1.2 angle minus 120 ib equal to 2.4 angle 120 delta winding current conventional method 0.578 equal to 1 by root 3 ir equal to 1.2 into 0.578 equal to 0.693 angle zero. I Y equal to 1.2 angle into 0.578 equal to 0.693 angle minus 120. I B equal to 2.4 into 0.578 equal to 1.38 angle 120. We know delta winding current ir equal to 0.693 angle 0 iy equal to 0.693 angle minus 120 ib equal to 1.388 angle 120 transformer r phase input current primary current equal to ir minus iy equal to 1.2 angle 30 that is 0.693 angle 0 minus 0.693 angle minus 120 transformer y phase current primary equal to iy minus ib that is 0.693 minus 120 minus 1.388 angle 120 equal to 1.836 angle minus 79 transformer b phase input current primary current equal to ib minus ir equal to 1.836 angle 139 delta winding current using positive sequence negative sequence current method transformer output current secondary current equal to ir equal to 1.2 angle 0 iy equal to 1.2 angle minus 120 ib equal to 2.4 angle 120 star side positive sequence current equal to 1.6 angle 0 negative sequence current equal to 0.4 angle minus 120 zero sequence current equal to 0.4 angle 120 transformer data is 415 by 14 that is only 1 
dy1 that is lv current lacks hg current by 30 dv delta side positive sequence current equal to 1.6 angle 30 negative sequence current equal to 0.4 angle minus 30 zero sequence current equal to 0.4 angle 120 no phase angle shift calculate the delta side current from positive sequence negative sequence without zero sequence current is IRL equal to IR minus IY equal to 1.2 angle 30. IY, IOL equal to y, IY minus IB equal to 1.836 angle minus 79.1. IBL equal to IB minus IR equal to 1.834 angle 139.1. Delta side line 0 sequence current equal to 0.4 angle 120. Delta side phase sequence current equal to 0 seconds phase, 0 seconds current equal to 0.4 angle 120 divided by root 3. IN equal to IR plus IY plus IB. That is equal to 3 into I0. That is equal to 3 into 0.4 angle 120 divided by root 3. Equal to root 3 into 0.4 angle 120 equal to 0.693 angle 120. That is sum of YB equal to 0.693 angle 120. IRL equal to IR minus IY equal to 1.2 angle 30. IOL equal to IY minus IB equal to 1.836 angle minus 79. From this we will form the matrix. Matrix multiplication. Matrix 1, 1, 1, 1 minus 1, 0, 0, 1 minus 1 into IR minus IR, IY, IB equal to IN, IRL, IOL. That is IR, IY, IB equal to 1, 1, 1, 1 minus 1, 0, 0, 1 minus 1 in uh, inverse into 0 0.693 angle 120, 1 1.2 angle 30, 1 1.836 angle minus 79. So, delta winding current IR equal to 0 0.693 angle 0, IY equal to 0 0.693 angle 1 minus 120, IB equal to 1.388 angle 120 in 3-number single phase transformer on 5-limb core type transformers cell type transformers flux produced by 0 seconds current will be circulated in the cores but in 3-limb core type transformers flux produced by 0 seconds current will be circulated through oil or tank 415 bar 230 volt 1440 VA Y YN0 10% transformer connection is shown here. Generally, a G side star connector with neutral only, but the neutral is removed due to some problem or it is burnt and the things, then it will form like a Y YN0. A G side is star but not no neutral. It means a transformer is connected to three wire system. LV side is star and a neutral is connected. Ejector, 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 or unbalanced load connected in LV side R phase, O phase, B phase. One side is connected to the transformer, another side is star connected and N neutral is formed. The neutral is written to your our transformer neutral. In zero sequence equivalent circuit, no zero sequence current in primary side and secondary side. It is equal to three wire system in primary side and secondary side. Conventional method: three numbers transformer, three numbers 415 bar 240 volt are connected. VTR equal to root three is to one. VRN equal to 240 angle 0, VYN equal to 240 angle minus 120, VBN 240 angle 120 primary voltages. VRN 138.6 angle 0, VYN 138.6 angle minus 120, VBN equal to 138.6 angle 120. EZR equal to 200 ohms, EZY equal to 200 ohms, EZB equal to 100 ohms. HG side, no neutral in star winding. 
So LV said no neutral current, no zero sequence current equal to three wire system and P is a start point of the load. Using minimum theorem, neutral displacement voltage equal to 34.65 angle 120 volt. So LV side currents are transformer R phase output current, secondary current IR equal to 138.6 angle 0 minus 34.65 angle 120 whole divided by 200. That is equal to 0.79 angle minus 10. Transformer Y phase output current, secondary current equal to IY equal to 138.6 angle minus 120 minus 34.65 angle 120 whole divided by 200 equal to 0.79 angle minus 109. Transformer B phase output current, secondary current IB equal to 138.6 angle 120 minus 34.65 angle 120 whole divided by 100 equal to 1.039 angle 120. Transformer R phase input current, primary current equal to IR equal to 0.79 angle minus 10 divided by root 3 equal to 0.458 angle minus 10. Transformer Y phase input current, primary current equal to IY equal to 0.79 angle minus 109 divided by root 3 that is equal to 0.458 angle minus 109. Transform B phase input current, primary current equal to IB equal to 1.039 angle 120 divided by root 3 equal to 0.6 angle 120. Now we are going to see the current through positive sequence negative sequence method. Star star winding current using positive sequence positive negative sequence method. Transformer output current, secondary current IR equal to 0.79 angle minus 10. Transformer Y phase Output current, secondary current, IY equal to 0.79 angle minus 109. Transformer B phase output current, secondary current equal to IB equal to 1.039 angle 120. Secondary current, star side, positive sequence current equal to 0.86 angle 0. Negative sequence current equal to 0.17 angle minus 120. Zero sequence current 0. Transformer data is 240 divided by 139 that is root 3 is to 1 y y n 0 primary star side positive sequence current equal to 0.86 angle 0 divided by root 3 equal to 0.497 angle 0 negative sequence equal to 0.17 angle minus 120 divided by root 3 equal to 0 0.098 angle minus 120 zero sequence current 0 Calculate the primary line current, star winding current, from positive sequence, negative sequence current, zero sequence current. IR equal to 0.46 angle minus 10.73. IY equal to 0.46 angle minus 109.3. IB equal to 0.8 angle 120. So, transformer R phase input current, uh, primary current, IR equal to 0.46 angle minus 10.73 transfer y phase input current primary current equal to iy 0.46 angle minus 109.3 transfer b phase input current primary current ib equal to 0.6 angle 120 from this video we understand number one dyn1 transformer load current Supply current, winding current with unbalanced load in secondary side. Primary is 3 wire system, second is 4 wire system. Number 2, YYN0. Transformer load current, supply current, winding current with unbalanced load in secondary side. Primary 3 wire system, secondary 3 wire system. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need any clarification, you can send mail to us. Our email ID is anbu.electric.y at gmail.com.